Here are some of the best UFC press conference moments of 2023. Don't don't Sports Center's top 10 plays coming in at number one. Sugar Shot O'Malley knocks out Aljamain. Poop stain! Sterling! You got your dogs, you lift weights, but Saturday evening, if you win, you become the heavyweight champion of the world. You have an after party here in Hakkasan. It's Las Vegas, Sin City. So how lit does John Jones get getting the victory Saturday evening? I'm not getting lit at all. You guys. <laughs> Amen. You guys don't want to see me lit. All right. Yeah, I, I just leave it at that. Yeah. <laughs> that first fight, that was the second fight. That wasn't the first. Apologies, already mad. What's the excuse for the first fight? What was the excuse for the first fight? What's the excuse for the, f head, the head kicking up? I dropped my hand. <laughs> There's no excuse. There was no it, excuse. Like, Beautiful it, technique. It, it my is, hand came is, down it. and you landed it. What was your excuse for the three rounds before that getting your head beat in? Get your head beat in. Your coach had to back Get you. Get held, held Come on, Rocky. Cage. Come on, this, Rock. This man Come had on, them Rock. worse. I left Come there on, Rock. unscathed. Not You're one. You bully, you son. Not one You're mark bully, on son. my face. You're getting All bullied, was, son. Get my gloves. You were bullied in the first fight. And you're going to be bullied again. You're getting bullied, son. You'll see. Don't let him bully you, son. You'll see. Don't let him bully you, son. You awake? You good? Don't let him bully you, son. That boy's concussed. You don't know what he's talking about. He's bullying you, son. He, he's Come on, concussed. Rock. concussed. Question four. Get your head out of your ass, Rock. He's bullying you, son. He got a concussion. You don't know what he's talking about. Yesterday at the media day, Neil had some words about you. Said he's going to give you an ass whooping, teach you a lesson. I'm curious what you thought when you heard those comments. I think Neil was given a f mic yesterday, and he should sit up here on the stage and say nothing. He put his foot in the dirt. If he speaks today, he's giving, he's going to be digging a hole. Nobody, nobody is allowed to ask Neil Magny a question today. He's to sit there and reflect on the that he said, because what he said was ridiculous. Why do you feel so strongly about it? Did you watch the clip? Did yes, you hear it? Yeah. So you heard word for word what came out of that man's mouth? Yes, I believe he said he was going we, to give you this We are thing. tackling a very, very big issue here, mate. And he should sit there and sit down, shut up, and just reflect on what he said. I will have to go to Neil. Neil, I'm curious what you think of when you hear no, this. No, 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 no. Neil's not answering a question. He's going to sit there and he's going to be quiet. Nobody. There is no right to ever put your hand on a kid. Ever. Discipline anything. You, you want to play with quiet. him so bad, bro. Mate, you're exactly mate, mate, that. mate, you're, you're a father. Exactly you never lay your hands on a child ever. You know exactly the Yesterday you, you said, fact, you, put, I'm yesterday you said, I'm a father. I've been accustomed to that type of beating. Yeah, dude. And you I'm going to whoop can, that ass on Saturday. You can play you'll do all you want. Nothing, you'll sit you there, you'll shut up, and you'll do what you're told. You can play victim all you want. You know what's going to happen Saturday night. Let's go. Drown him out. I want to hear you scream when he speaks, yeah? Yeah, make sure you guys show up to carry your mouth hey, too. Mate, honestly, shut your mouth. Don't dig a hole. Ed, I was, oh uh, yeah. Hey, right. don't talking, dig talking, a man. hole. Shut right, up. up. Keep talking. I'll talk all day long. On Saturday night, I'll jab you in the mouth and I'll break that nose. I guarantee you won't. I guarantee I will slap the out of you. Do up it. Down the mat. I guarantee mate, you. Mate, I you get beat by everybody. You're going to try to clinch and have a boring fucking fight. <laughs> Which one do you want? I guarantee you. Mate, what are you going to do? You're gonna put me up to the cage, you're gonna try to clinch, you're gonna have a boar fest. I guarantee it. I guarantee it. Guarantee what? Night. You're getting your ass whooped every night. I guarantee it. Wait till Wait, Whose ass night. have you ever whooped? The guy you're training with to try to beat me. That's, bro. What, that's for one. Bro, like, what are you, you took this fight in seven days' like, notice. What are you talking about? I got a long, lanky like, orthodox. What are you talking about? I'm gonna whoop your fing ass. You won't do a damn thing. Shut the f up. Uh, who damn has thing. the next question? Let's go. We are here. Uh, unfortunately, Kaikara France is a is in front of me, and you are fucking guilty because Sunday this kid's gonna be get murdered, you know? Because you, you hey, fucking calm down, calm down. You yeah. afraid because uh, no, you oh, you get accused. You have uh, three weeks to fight me, you little. F Look at you. You have the chorus to come here, to stage. Yes, yeah, stand up, mother Stand up, mother Stand the fuck up, mother What you want? What you want? 
What you want to? What you want? All right, yeah, yeah. Shut the f up, man. Sit down. Your things is with Shrika. Sit the f down. Sit the f down. Set the f down, yo. Shut the f up. Sit the f down, bro. Sit the f down. Sit the f down. What the f? Bitch, that's what. Sit the f down, yo. Look at this little midget trying to f with me. I will f bury you. What the fuck you are? What the fuck you are? Shut your mouth. Hey, I'm here. I'm here. Relax. 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 He was able to win the Australian fans over. You're a proud South African. How do you think the South African fans feel about Sean Strickland? The South African fans. Uh, they don't care about Sean Strickland. They are only caring about one thing, is getting that belt home. Being world champions, what we are, and I'm gonna prove that in January 20th. You know, he said he's gonna walk through me, and I'm glad that you know you won't finish me. You won't even get close, but don't worry. It won't be enough I don't got to worry about to finishing you. About. Your coach will finish you in the back like you're used to. Don't worry about that. You're going to get finished that night. Your coach got you. Bro, why are you so angry? Bro, you think your dad beat the shit up you? you, you, you your dad doesn't have shit on me. I'm going to show you what it's like to Dragus. beat you. I mean, all, every childhood memory you have is going to come back when I'm in there with you. Every single one, the one where you lie in bed at night where your dad thing, comes man. in and he beats the shit I out of you. I will take your soul, you understand me, you Please. Yeah, you laugh, you Yeah, oh, I got a nerve. I see I hit a nerve there. Yeah, you did hit a nerve, you bitch. <laughs> Go ice your ankle, you coward. Oh, man, that's All right, thing. guys, I'm going to oh. square these guys off and uh, for and photo I'm up. you up, Dry. Thanks this. for coming, we appreciate Leave it. Leave me after, you bitch. Well, hey, yesterday at the hotel, there appeared to be a run-in between yourself and Kevin Holland. I was curious, what was that about? Absolutely nothing. You know, there's there's nothing to talk about there. It's just some dick-riding, cloud-chasing bitch, you know, so ain't nothing to talk about. Nah, that's not what she was saying yesterday, bro. Watch your f mouth. Kevin, I'm curious, what appears, what is the issue there? I called him wait, baby wait, girl and he got mad. Guys, come on, these two aren't even fighting. Knock it off. All right. Okay. Well, what, do you have a question about the fight, who these guys are fighting, or you just want to start shit in here? What's question. your question? Nothing yeah. to gain from this fight. In his mind, he already lost. Me? I've already lost. Whatever, you sausage. Your own country doesn't even like you, dude. Lad, just because everyone likes you here, lad, it's going to be funny when you're on the, on the floor asleep on Saturday night. I don't even care about you, dude. I don't even... I know you don't. I don't care about you. You're just another obstacle in the way, lad. You, you care about me blocking you on Saturday, Instagram? Lad? That's what you care about. You care about the most stupidest shit. No, I I'm don't. worried about everybody else. Lad, you must think, care because you blocked me. I'm not that much of a little to block someone on Instagram. You know what? I'm not that sensitive, yeah. bitch. I didn't even have to look at little you. Little sensitive boy. Don't call oh, me a little boy. I made you my little boy making you block. Go make me, me a cup of tea, pussy. bitch. Oh, Jesus. Your head's gone, lad. You need to grow up. You're about 14 in the edge, you little nit. Anybody ever get what he said? I don't understand one word like you, buddy. You don't have to, but when I'm standing over your unconscious body on Saturday night like Michael Chandler, you'll Keep know dreaming. the Keep boy dreaming, is. Baby. Keep dreaming, baby. Keep dreaming, dude. That shit is not gonna happen. Ketchup sandwich, I'm gonna cut you so bad, they're gonna have to stitch you I up. Don't I want you to. Cut me open like you said you're gonna do, because I'll be standing over you, ground and pounding your unconscious skull. I'm gonna you little fucking bum. open. I'm gonna cut you so open, you have Do no it then, lad. Do it. I can't wait. You've never seen your own blood. I can't believe you've actually got a stage. suit on, lad. Every other day, you're like oh, an eight-year-old what's just dressed himself for the wait first to time. Cut you up. Look like a it's been idiot. a long time since I brought the blades out, baby, and it's gonna. Bring the blades out, then, lad. You said you've been gonna cut your last six opponents. You can't do all against them because you're an old crab. Oh, Shut your mouth, son of a bitch. You have to know. Little kid, you're bringing the heat out of me right now on Saturday. I know. I can't wait to bring the heat out of you. I hope the, the old Tony turns up, not this all washed up. Well, here we go. We got a heartbeat out of you now because earlier you were boring. Do shit. something then. Know what I mean? Yeah, Stop cool, talking. Man. Here you got a heartbeat. Take your shades now. off, lad. You got a heartbeat. I had to now. stare me out before and looked away first. I've already beat you mentally. You haven't got a clue. I'm going to cut down. your hair off of Put my elbow. the mic down. 
with your you're shitty done. watch you're on. Done. You're done, you little nit. Done, you dumb what? What, is that a toy watch you've got on there? Absolutely. S-Force watches, check them out in my two. You yeah. get that watch out of a kinder egg. Full violence hey. by a shirt. You guys know. Get that watch out of a children's toy. Oh, oh get a watch. You, you are little a kid. clown. You are a kid and I'm gonna see oh, I'm gonna send you back home, you little Bull. bitch. Go ahead. Question for the former champion, Israel Adesanya. When you stand at the podium making your Hall of Fame speech one day, where do you visualize this fight camp, this soon to be war for USC 287 ranking among the career milestones? You mean the fight camp or the fight? The fight. This fight, like I've said, this is my eight, eight mile moment. This is it. One more shot at this. I put everything on my back. I've done everything in my power to make sure I do the worst thing to this man this weekend. I'm, I'm done with this talking shit. You guys want to hear me talk or you want to hear me fight? Ele fez isso nas últimas três lutas. Ele falou a mesma coisa e não fez. Who did this the past three fights? He said the same things it and there's always that. I don't even understand what I said. Not understand what you said. What's going to happen this weekend is we're going to fight and see who the best man is at the end. Ele me faz rir. He makes me laugh. Of a slug. He makes Usman look like James Brown. The <laughs> he, knocked, he knocked you out. Miles. He didn't knock me out. He didn't knock me out, dude. <laughs> tell you tell you me out. The ref had to <laughs> cheat. I beat his ass for oh, five rounds straight. Everyone's a cheat when you get you got your out, ass right? beat the first Everyone, time, the second time. You're a bum. Bro, you're right? a idiot. Then get you might be the stupidest after, right? guy on the UFC roster. Literally, you're so stupid. On Saturday night, I'm going to bring you to a place you never want to be. I'm going to bring you the seventh layer hair. Hell. Okay. No, I'm bringing you to seventh layer hell. You, we'll, we'll, we'll say what's up to your dad while we're there. Oh! Yeah, look, at him. No, look, he's got his ultimate feeling champion. He ain't no ultimate fighting champion. He's ultimate feeling champion. Wow. Guys, Kleenex and you better get the tissues ready. Seventeen seventy six, baby. This is the American Revolution. General Washington started it, General Covington ends it. Colby Covington has described you as a pathetic excuse of a oh, human being. This, hey, how many let me see you guys Colby fans in here? Give me a show of hands. You guys let me let me give you some facts on Colby. Colby is an utter piece of shit. What do you know about facts? No, you can't no, even no, read, no, bro. Explain to Colby what Colby is. If you know Colby on a personal level, he f***ed over everybody he knows. And I take, I take Colby as a personal insult to me. Because the Trumpsters, the Republicans, you guys are my people. The blue collar workers, you guys are my people. And you have a like Colby, a like Colby, come in here and take it up the banner. He don't give a about you. And him making fun of uh, Leon's dad, that is the biggest move you can do. That is the biggest move to do. Leon's mom, Leon's mom, dad, bad guy, good guy, doesn't matter. He raised the boy. She raised the boy to be a man, to win a title, to be a good man. And a real American would, a, would applaud him for that. They wouldn't tear him down for that. So just so you know, Colby is a fake And if he was standing here right next, to me, the only thing he would do is call 911 because he is the definition of a bitch. I'm there, hard time, and uh, I have many things before the fight, but here, everything on my side, I have time for the... What, what things? Get it out there, what things? Man, what, when the beginning event in Australia, when? Five in the morning? Well, five in the morning what? 
Well, you're, you're telling me 30 something hours. What is time enough? we fight? What time? How many hours ten, do you need rehydration? Ten I am. I need oh, usually Mate, what I we need, have. I don't need any of that. I I'll need, fight on zero need, hydration. You don't need nothing. Just money. Everybody know you why say, you come. You say you say that I yeah, need how much? Let's go, guys. Tell Wait. the people how much more they give you for the took the fight. Hey, how much you make money? It's well deserved, mate. Don't worry about that. Uh -huh. But hey, hey. Now I'm you listening. understand, mate. What do you mean? I'm here. Hey, I'm in my prime, as you can see, and I got that dog in me. I don't know if you can see that, but I got a nice dog. Yeah, prime. So I'm ready to put too. on a show. Prime I back myself too. every single time. I don't Just need make 10 money, extra hours shut up and go home. You rely on your. You rely on the the hometown advantage. Ten extra hours rehydration. I back my skills. That's it. I'm going to silence the crowd again! Again! Wait, wait, wait. You think I can lose to a guy who dresses up in a velour suit? And his team? And his team? Look at these clowns. Look at these it's clowns. It's gonna match. It's gonna match very well my gold belt Saturday that? night. Ah, oh, sit your ass down. Hey, you did nothing. You did nothing the other day, right? So shut your ass up. And you, and you, and you, and you. Hey, can I say something real quick? Because this man's got to make something. weight first. Say something. You have to make weight first. And if you can't make weight, but Rob, you're next. Get ready, Brooks. I'm coming for you. Because I'm coming for you. If this man doesn't make weight, make sure he has his, his, his butt buddy at Brokeback Longo, because you're next. Hey, one more. Hey, at least I don't quit, Henry. At least I don't quit. I always make weight. I always show up. I'm and here to you're collect. dead! I'm gonna collect you're dead! Take that, that gold chain off. I'm gonna rush your neck. Wait. Your gold chain. How do you, how do you like fun? Uh, 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 uh. That gold chain. That too. big ass head. Look at that dome piece, Get bro. That Get dome out of here. Make that weight. I will. Hey, be ready. Well, be man. ready. Because I know he's struggling to make weight. Be ready. Be Wait. ready. You see me struggle, Henry? You be ready. Struggle. It's too struggle to make weight. I'm gonna hurt you, bro. You want me I'm gonna do it under he three. He wants me in this and everything so that I said, I've done. I'm taking on three. Hey, one more question. There's some curious. Who do you think wins between Shafkat and Stephen Thompson? No one gives a f about that. They came to see me, and that's it. I'm the A side of this fight. They didn't come to see anybody else. I don't care who's on my prelims. Why would I care about who's on my prelims? I'm Shut focused on Mumble Mouth. Shut the the most impressive I'm thing the about Mumble Mouth. Mouth is that he has you, a Kobe. list. I'm the main event, dog. Bumbles. I'm more American than you, homie. Sit back. Wow, this Benedict Arnold mother Damn, Tony, I was rooting for you. Uh, you know, I like America. You know, I'm still gonna root for you, even if you're an American douchebag, but just don't go out there and lose seven fights in a row, bro. Oh, homie, you know what? You're in my weight class. Yeah, brother. You're forget, you're in my weight class, kid. So you're next. Kid, you're in the easiest weight class in the UFC. What are you talking about? 14 and 2, most knockouts, bitch. Six fight losing streak, bitch. 155. 170. <laughs> yeah, bum, because you can't come to a real man's weight class. Everybody knows 70 is the premier division of the UFC. Hey, get Trump's sack out of your mouth, bro. You got anything else, though? Bro, you must still be knocked out when you got kicked by Michael Chandler, dude. I might be. So I woke up, dude, and I realized how American I am, man. So you I'm going to be real. Still. Hey, you I'm still see real. a ghost in the wall? going to be fucking real. The stars and stripes are going nowhere. Still they kidnapping here. your kids? You so regardless if this like wins and I win, we're going to keep that here. Yeah, we'll see. That was a compliment, bitch. Yeah, I'm complimenting you too. I'm rooting for you on Saturday night. All right, Kobe, let's fucking do this shit. Let's go, Team America. F yeah, America, motherfucker. Fuck yeah, God bless. Here we go, motherfucker. Raise up the yeah! revolution. We're gonna Paul Revere these assholes. <laughs> Damn right we are. F these red coat motherfuckers. Hoorah. Last time I did a cool dance, then I knocked him out. This time I'm gonna knock him out and do another cool dance. And he's gonna hold up a Chinese flag and swear allegiance to the CCP, man. Grow a pair of nuts and grow a fine. You don't even he's represent your country when you sell out. When did you sign a Monster Energy? When did you sell your soul? Tell me. Hey, you you know, signed your soul recently, bro, right? You did. I ride motorcycles. Isn't it funny, Isn't it funny like that anytime I have time. to fight someone, Monster signs them immediately and becomes a fan of them? You know why? Because I didn't sell out and I didn't sell my soul. What'd you have to do to that pig head of huh? What'd you have to do to sell your hey, soul to get that deal? Let me tell you something about, about my man Izzy. Let's talk about Izzy's last, last, last show out, right? Whenever, whenever Drake is one. Doesn't won. matter, I knocked him out. Let's he talk knocked about, you the let's fuck talk out. about whenever Drake is one. 
Izzy is on a world stage, world stage, and he goes up in the cage to call out Drykus and he race baits him. Like, literally, bro, that's your message? You race bait him? And not only that. You're a neo Nazi. The fuck are you talking about? Not only that, not only that, you guys. He wears a shirt to shit on his ex girlfriend. This is the kind of champion we have, and it's a goddamn shame. And hey, listen to what? Listen to what, you guys? Let me stand up for this. I'm gonna be honest. When I was younger, when I was younger, bro, I went through some traumatic shit, as we all did, man, from seventh grade when I learned my lesson. And as a man, as a man, I'm a better man for it. I live a good life. I do good things. I'm not jerking my dog off, swearing allegiance to China, on my ex-girlfriend. So again, man, people can change. I have repented. God damn, I'm proud of who the I am. Are you proud of who you are? For more videos like this, subscribe to MMA Crazy on YouTube.